presented by Squarespace. Okay, so I'm back. You probably have already watched the iPhone 6 Plus Ben test, but I got a huge number of requests to do another device. So I have a Note 3 here, which is a similar form factor, and people just wanna know, I guess, is, is this bending something to be expected on any device this size? We're about to find out. But one more thing I wanna mention about the 6 Plus, as I attempted to bend it back, to its original form, it cracked in that location and it also cracked the glass on the screen as I hope you can see there in that image. So we ended up with a crack after all, so a little bit less usable than just a bend. So I don't know what my recommendation is. If yours ends up bent, probably just leave it that way because when you attempt to bend it back, you might very well end up cracking the display along with it. But enough about the 6 Plus. Is this unusual for a large device? Let's find out now using the Note 3. Let's go. So this Note 3 was actually dead, so I just got a battery backup here to charge it up. Should have checked that before I started recording. But this is amazing. With the same or maybe more force, this thing hasn't bent at all. Or it bent, it, I mean it bent as I was doing it. It was creaking and making all, all kinds of crazy noises, but ultimately no damage. Let's go ahead one more time here and try this again with it plugged in this time. It's just plugged into a battery backup, so here we go. That is as hard as I can push. And nothing. Oh, it's a little warped. It's a little bit warped. You can probably see that. It's a tiny bit warped, but Wow, that device is completely functioning. That's crazy. So the Galaxy Note 3 survives the exact same bend test that the iPhone 6 Plus failed. That I did not expect with a plastic build, but there you have it. Materials like plastic in many ways offer, I don't know, the best solution for durability in some cases. I guess this is a good example of that. Obviously, not the most beautiful material to hold in your hand, but if you're looking for something <laughs> that can withstand a torture test like this, then I guess the Note technically wins this particular battle. We'll have to wait and see what happens with the Note 4 when it comes out. It's launching very shortly, but at this moment, we have a completely functional Note 3 with very little battery power because I didn't have it charged in advance. Anyways, that wraps up this video. These were some painful tests to do, although in this particular case, the Note 3 survived. But let me know what you think down in the comments. Is that what you expected to see? Probably not. All right, that wraps up this video. Leave a thumbs up down below if you approve of it or enjoyed it or found it to be informative in any way possible. Subscribe if you haven't yet, and I'll catch you on the next episode later. Squarespace, the all-in-one platform that makes it fast and easy to create your own professional website, portfolio, and online store for a free trial and 10% off. Visit squarespace.com unbox and enter offer code unbox at checkout. A better web starts with your website. Now get to it. I can't